Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and welcome to the 700k giveaway. I promised we'd do something really special when the channel turned to over 700,000 subscribers, so today's the day. All right, so here's the deal. I'm going to be giving away a super high-end guitar. Now, I could just randomly pick any guitar and say, hey, here's what we're giving away. But since we're celebrating subscribers, I'm going to let you guys choose which guitar to give away, which is going to be a lot of fun. So I've gone ahead and picked eight of my favorite super high-end guitars. I'm going to post a video every day this week, and we're going to battle them head-to-head -head until just one guitar remains, and then we're gonna give it away. So that's all there is to it. To be eligible, you just have to be a subscriber to the channel. So if you haven't subscribed yet, be sure to do so. Let's start with round one. All right, you guys, here are the guitars I've chosen for round one. Ibanez versus Ormsby. Only one guitar can move on as chosen by you guys. So I'll give a quick 30 second rundown of each instrument and we'll go from there. First up, Ibanez Prestige, made in Japan, ultra lightweight at six pounds, incredibly thin, super ergonomic, pickups sound amazing. There's no compromises on this guitar. The playability, the construction, you know, locking tuners, titanium reinforced neck. Uh, the spec list is way too long to list here, but it's lightweight, it's ergonomic. It's like the best Japan has to offer in terms of like a high performance guitar. So I don't think this guitar in this finish is available anymore. So if you like this, I think it's Wild Pilsner Burst, uh, this might be your chance to grab it. So vote it on if you like this guitar. Uh, absolutely exquisite. Now going up against the Ibanez is one of the coolest guitars I've ever seen. This is the Ormsby Shark with its kind of like multi-scale fan fret layout individual shark inlays on the frets, the hammerhead cutout here, and a beautiful quilt top that transitions from the beach all the way to the deep sea in color. A splittable humbucker, just like so. Three-way switch. It's just a beauty to behold. Glue-in neck joint there. A definitely a chunkier neck than the Ibanez. The Ibanez has a very thin neck. This one flattens out really nicely on the back, but it's got much more shoulders. So if you like kind of a bigger chunkier neck, uh, this is the way to go. But the fretwork on this is impeccable and just the overall construction. It's just a beautiful, cool guitar. So if you like this, vote for the Ormsby. This is the Ormsby Shark. All right, so here's how we're going to vote to see which guitar moves on. Now, YouTube no longer allows us to use polls, so I'm just going to keep it dirt simple. I'm going to drop two comments on this video. Like the Ibanez comment to see the Ibanez move on. Like the Ormsby comment to see the Ormsby move on. That's it. So whichever comment has the most likes, well, that's the guitar that's going to move to the next round. So. Go down to the comments and vote. All right, you guys. Well, that's round one. We'll leave the voting open till the end of the week. Come back tomorrow for round two. Thanks for subscribing to the channel, you guys. Take care.